You know, sitting in front of this camera and really trying to come to you guys with messages, messages that I'm personally number one, first and foremost, messages that I'm proud of, messages that I feel are well thought out, well articulated, something that, you know, is going to be of quality and of substance to reach you guys, reach somebody, one person to where if you listen, you hear and say, you know what? It's something that this guy said. It unlocked something in me. It motivated me to get up and just take a step that I've never taken before. Like this is not easy, guys. It's not easy and I found myself, you know, for the last few days not getting in front of the camera because I wasn't inspired and I'm, and I'm looking around trying to be inspired and in order for me to do this, it's not like I can just read off something and come with, with a bunch of notes and give you guys some regurgitated or some coarse mess that, you know, I don't even believe in. For me to give it to you, I have to be inspired. So I wait for my inspiration or I try to look around, you know, things that may have took place in my life or, or friends and family's life or be able to be to, to be observant what's going on in people's lives that I can speak to and hopefully encourage and motivate. And sometimes you don't get those messages. And within these last few days, I just started to doubt. I just started to, to you know, because I listen to other speakers. It's just something that I enjoy doing. And, and, you know, especially now, I just need to be motivated myself. I need to, to really, you know, listen to somebody and hear something, something that might spark something in me so that I can come back to you guys and, and, and really give you something that, that, you know, hopefully is, is, powerful and something that's going to make you sit up and say, you know what? I never thought of that before. He said it in a way that just, you know, really turned something that switched on in me. And now I'm ready to go. And listening to these other guys, I mean, you know, and not being in front of the camera, it just made me doubt. And it's like, you know what, Sean, you know, you really as good as you think you are. Are you really going to be able to, to inspire and touch the millions that you hope to and, and really be able to have people's lives change based on your words? And then it just occurred to me, like in every other business endeavor that I've ever had, Sean, just keep moving forward. Just keep moving forward, you know. This is a calling. It's something that you have to do. Now do it. Get in front of the camera. And that's why I come in front of the camera today because really when you sit and think about it, it it's, you, you know, I had to really like really give myself some real thought. And it comes down to, you know, the doubt creeps in, but the doubt creeps in because you don't think you're worthy. And I had to ask myself, Am I worthy? Am I worthy to speak to the masses? Am I worthy to stand on stages and, and get before audiences and go toe to toe with the big boys? And the answer is yes. And I know some of you guys are on your journey. You're on your path. You're thinking about your next steps and, and, and should I even start? And it really comes down to, are you worthy? And I'm telling you, yes, you are. You are worthy. You're worthy of the big house. You're worthy of the big boy toys. You're worthy of all of the, of, of the dreams and, and, and all of the, the success and all of the things that you have seen, but you couldn't necessarily imagine it for yourself. And when you do imagine it for yourself, you get shell shock. You get into this fear mode where you're like, whoa, 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 I'm almost afraid of my own success. That can never be me. It, it could happen to somebody else. It just wouldn't happen to be me. I'm just telling you, you are worthy. And that's when, whenever fear creeps in, whenever doubt creeps in, you have to look at it for what it's worth. And really take a breath, take a step back and understand nobody's any different than me. But I am worthy. I'm worthy of a great relationship. I'm worthy of a great career. I'm worthy of creating a billion dollar business. I'm worthy. I'm worthy. And if you can come to this place 
and know that you know that you know that you really are worthy, then I think that that's the, not just the starting place, but every time, even with, with myself, every time that you, you know, have those moments of doubt, have those moments of fear, have those moments of, you know what, I don't know. Was I really supposed to be doing what I'm doing? You got to step back and just understand. Yes, I am. And I'm worthy of everything that's about to come to me. It is so easy, so easy for us to accept everybody else's successes. It's so easy for us to accept the fact that somebody else did something. Why can't we? Why can't we have that same acceptance for, for ourselves? Why can't we say, you know what? If they can do it, if he can do it, if she can do it, so can I. Because I'm worthy. This is a thought I want to leave with you guys today. Because at the end of the day, it's doable. It's achievable. It really is up to you. Do you have that belief? Do you have that self-confidence? Do you have the, the, the thing inside of you that doesn't just drive you, but the thing inside of you that knows that if I get out on that playing field, I'm going to bust their behinds. I'm going to compete at a level that they have never seen before. I'm going to bring something that's so unique to the table that it will change the industry. And that unique thing is you. It's your ideas. It's, 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 it's your vernacular. It's your insight. But you got to be, you, you, you got to first start off in a place of knowing that you're worthy. Because when all of these things come to you, when, it, when, when, when all of your dreams start to, to be fulfilled and you start to understand like, whoa, my hard work wasn't in vain. You know, there's so many people out there, they're rich and they're depressed. You want when they come to you, you can be ecstatic. And you knew from the gate, this was destined to me. And I'm going to live and enjoy the fruits of my labor. Do me a favor, guys. Know that you're worthy. Know that your destiny is in your hands. And know that no matter what, you got to keep moving forward. Peace and love. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. All love. Make every move a power move. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.